Managing slurries, a problem many farmers will relate to. Traditionally, slurries are removed by tanker and onto stubble, or through irrigation systems that have to be situated quite close to the slurry pits. Not always ideal in terms of making the best use of the nutrients or minimising pollution. The England Catchment Sensitive Farming Delivery Initiative has been working with farmers to promote more efficient, lower risk methods to manage and spread slurry. This works to minimise water pollution and at the same time maximise crop nutrient uptake. There are two main issues with traditional slurry spreading techniques. One is that, uh, that they tend to be carried out mainly in the autumn which leads to higher nutrient losses over winter and of course the, the actual spreading isn't as accurate as with newer methods that are available. Of course the other problem is, is the smell nuisance factor to neighbours which is an indication of the ammonia loss from the sprayed slurry. Richard Mortimer is a farmer in the Waveney catchment area. He runs A&M Contracting with his partner Richard Ames. We first worked with a catchment sensitive farming officer when we applied for a grant to put a shed over our muck pad to try and reduce the amount of water we're putting into the slurry lagoon. Being farmers ourselves, we understand the problems that slurry can cause. It's partly the reason why we set up the slurry spreading business to help other farmers and also to safeguard our own benefits back here on the farm. A&M Contracting offer a slurry spreading service using a full width boom drop hose system. An umbilical pipe fed boom places the slurry through drop hoses. A GPS guidance system Continuous monitoring of flow rate and forward speed allow the target application rate to be achieved the whole time. Well, the slurry is dropped straight out of the booms onto the crop canopy. Because it goes straight onto the growing crop, there's no risk of it being blown away by the wind and no loss of ammonia to the atmosphere. Because there's no loss of ammonia to the atmosphere, there's no problem with neighbours or local villagers complaining about the smell when we spread slurry. Adopting a slurry application like A&M Contracting's boom system can offer the following benefits to your farm. Spreading can take place when farm machinery and labour are busy. It gives you the ability to spread in areas and at times that were previously unavailable, like into growing crops. This helps crops make the best use of the available nitrogen. It reduces pollution risks and you can be confident you comply with the NVZ regulations. More accurate spreading lets you be more confident to offset bagged fertiliser, cutting waste and saving money. We offer free advice to farmers, which we hope will reduce pollution to watercourses and, and to the rivers, and at the same time they can make some more money as well. The advice is free in priority areas. To find out more about how the ECS FDI can help improve slurry management on your farm, please contact 0800-6000-6000.